Hey, attention crypto gossipators, things are about to get interesting. Remember, not financial advice. Hey guys, what is up? Hope everyone is doing well. Hope everyone's having an amazing day because I am as usual, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back. So, guys, we as a community need to start thinking big and outside the box. So everything we say and do may actually turn into reality. And I'm talking about Shiba Inu ETFs, right? This may actually be for you something that is maybe delusional or too, too far away. But guess what, guys? A few years ago, not that long ago, cryptos were seen as an absolute joke, an absolute joke. When Bitcoins first came out, um, I don't know if you guys heard about the story of the most expensive pizza bought with Bitcoins. Guess what? People just really thought it was a complete joke. And guess how far we went? Bitcoin ETF. So this is like already traditional finance. This is already, you know, that next step of legitimacy towards cryptos. So the big question right now is, can we actually get a Shiba Inu ETF? As you guys can see on the article here, and that title, Shiba Inu Community Petitions Grayscale to Launch SHIB ETF. And yes, yes, we should maybe start right now. I can't give you an exact date, right? I can't tell you uh, what time it's going to happen, which month, day, and so on. But if we can start taking action, if we can already start seeing the future and pushing for things to happen in the future, then perhaps it's possible. Why not? Why not? Many things were seen as like literally impossible. Look at Bitcoin ETFs, the amount of times it got uh, rejected. It was seen as like almost unbelievable. But guess what? It happened in the end. And this could actually be the case for Shiba Inu. Why not? And if this does happen for Shiba Inu, ladies and gentlemen, it's going to be crazy. I'm talking volume moves capital just crazy, just crazy amounts of everything going in, right? And what cryptos need is volume. It needs movement. It needs action. Because when things are just, you know, too stable, uh, if nothing is really going on, that is very, very sad. Okay? So I think you guys should start really understanding where we, st where we stand and how our vision is supposed to broaden and we're supposed to be looking 10 steps ahead if we want to be you know the best of the best and make it to the top there's no reason for ship etfs not to be launched at some point right there's a big argument of when of course you know i can't tell you if it's this year next year the, the year after but things are really starting to progress and i think you know as shiba inu is in the top 20 in cryptos it has all the rights it has all the opportunities to make it this far. Really, guys. And I think if we see a few more ETFs, we're probably going to see the next one is going to be Ethereum. Right? And so on. And I think Shiba Inu is definitely going to make it up there. It's going to be one of the first ones. So when it does, the amount of money that could pour in is going to be immense. Insane. Look at Bitcoin. Look at how many billions of dollars started pouring in. Look at how it's seen right now. Look at how many new investors come in. And I'm talking about those that would never ever think about cryptos. It's all possible. There's a lot going on. So you have to start opening your eyes and understanding the full scale of things. Very, very beautiful future ahead of us, right? Um, but... Before, you know, you guys are going to uh, get all crazy at me and, and say, well, what are you even talking about? Look, action has been taken, right? So the petition now listed on the change.org platform began on February 25th and was specifically directed to Grayscale CEO Michael uh, Sonashane. Uh, the publicity for the Shiba Inu ETF proposal is being spearheaded by pseudonymous community builder, ship VPP. So 
I know you're going to say, well, who should be PP? And uh, this is like an absolute joke. But we're at least putting ourselves to the public eye. We're getting more exposure. We're trying to get, you know, in contact with these type of CEOs that are very, very powerful. They have the ability to make these type of movements. So I think if we were to look at everything, you know, together, we could potentially, you know, get this community riling up. We could get this community active enough to sign these petitions and to show that we are interested. We want change. We are prepared for this change. You get what I'm trying to say. Sometimes uh, some people would argue, well, do we even need ETFs? Of course we need ETFs. Why not? Why not? Right? Um, so the sponsors of the petition that argued that this popularity indicates its ecosystem's readiness for a ship based ETF. Secondly, they argue that with a ship ETF, there will be ease of accessibility to investors and move that will simply simplify the embrace of the token. And they argue that being an ERC20 token, Shiba Inu already passes the Howey to test as a non-security. As a result, Grayscale would not have any regulatory issues with launching a ship ETF. So... You see how we're placed also, you get what I'm trying to say here, that already we are considered a non-security, um, we've passed the test, on top of it, from all the credibility, from all the holders, from all the interest coming in, um, and for us, you know, just generally looking like a healthy um, crypto for in case these irregulatory issues happen, we could easily, uh, you know, defend ourselves and we have everything ticked, all the boxes ticked. So why not? Why not? If these ETFs, if these crypto ETFs start really popping off, I think uh, Shiba Inu could be at the top, one of, you know, the, the top 10 being selected. And another thing, ladies and gentlemen, um, I want to make it very clear that Right now, probably all the eyes are on Bitcoin ETFs and everybody's just trying to figure out how is this all working out. Um, so, you know, you're going to have to give it some time for everyone to realize that these ETFs have been very valuable, that they make sense, that everything has been delivered as promised and that we can just move on and create more ETFs. So is it going to happen tomorrow? No, but with your patience, with your time, with all the, you know, uh, regulatory systems, everything, uh, watching, if they really see real value behind it and security and so on, why not? We're next in line, right? Um, and another point that needs to be made is a lot of you are screaming, shouting, you want the one cent dream, you want the great things to come and happen. Look, nothing's going to happen without any action, without any moves. So this is the definition of action. This is the definition of moves. So if you can't, you know, process uh, this type of info, right? And I'm talking about a potential launch of a ship ETF. If you, if you can't be on the side, uh, uh, on the favorable side of this actually happening, then you may be very, very lost, ladies and gentlemen because this will be happening in the future. This is something that the whole community is gonna be pushing towards. And I think the more holders we have, and we have a massive, a massive community, one, more than 1.3 million holders, why wouldn't this happen, right? That, that's a big question. I don't see any reasons for it not happening. The only thing is that maybe I could see uh, the, the question of time, right? Because uh, you're going to have to be a bit more patient. But after the bull run, you know, after we see another pump, um, if obviously if we get a lot, you know, a dub double the amount of holders coming in and we start signing these petitions, we start uh, really promoting this whole idea, it could be possible. Many things in the past that we have wanted, uh, that we saw, uh, well, wasn't really happening right so certain things it seemed like they weren't happening but the, we came together as a community and we got it sorted right um so i think if we can get certain things sorted then why couldn't we get this thing sorted remember back in the days how we were fighting for robin hood 
Um, and other listings. Also Shibarium. Many people doubted Shibarium it came out. So you see how things generally come out. They're all we need is just interest from the community. If there is interest, if there is genuine vision for it, and if you are willing to stick along, and remember the average ship holder um, is holding ship probably for more than 10 years. And it, uh, out of all the cryptos, it is one of the most, uh, well, one of the longest held cryptos on average. So if you were to put together everything, I think we are in for a treat for sure. So let's see how this all progresses. Um, leave your thoughts down below. What do you think of SHIB ETFs? Is it long time to wait for? Or is this going to happen soon? Is this even possible? Let me know down below in the comment section. Don't forget to like, share, all that great stuff. Really does matter. And from my side, a big thank you to everyone. I appreciate all the support. And I'll see you in my next video. Peace out.